You ain't never doing a company, but you saying like, bro, if I see 10 niggas walking on the highway and getting ran the fuck over, like, it don't take no fucking genius to be like, hey, I ain't gonna lie. I'm not finna walk on the highway and get ran over, my nigga. Like, bro. Get! Got a lot of shit on my mind. I'm so with y'all boys, man. This is KJ Lee, and I'm back with another vid, man. Today, I'm finna give y'all a vid on how not to get scammed in this trading industry. Now, this trading industry, bro, like, this shit has the most scammers I've ever seen in my life. Like, it's scammers on Instagram, Twitter, like, anywhere. It's people scamming on all forms of trading. The main one they scam on is Forex, but don't get me wrong, they... They scam on that crypto, they scam on everything. So I'm gonna give y'all like a path to follow on how not to fall for these scams. All right, so number one, like if someone DMs you on Instagram, and I know like some of these, y'all gonna be like, bro, of course we know this, but I'm telling you, bro, people fall for these scams every single day. If these niggas follow you on Instagram and then DM your ass like, hey, bro, like you should learn, like, bro, number one, that's like, you should know like that's a scam. Like, come on now. You should know that's a scam. Somebody DM you like, hey, bro, let's make this money, bro. Come on, bro. If a nigga really getting after it with bread, bro, he not finna hit your ass up. Let's just be honest, bro. But that was that one was just obvious. Number two, like, you need, if you're gonna buy a course in them or you're going to invest your own bread into what they're doing or what you feel like that could help you pursue your dreams of trading, you need to see them actually trading live. I know, I know a lot of people might disagree with this, bro, like, but I feel like they need to have trade breakdowns, live trading. Like, you need to see that. You need to see some form of that. Just because they have, like, bro, do not buy no course from no nigga just because they have some testimonies and they have this shit right here. MT4 fucking statements, bro. That's the thing with the Forest community, bro. Like, I feel like a lot of niggas fall for this. Just because they have some shit like this, and the profit would be like, oh, 10,000 or something, don't mean it's real. Like, with the forest community or like with just MetaTrader and shit like that, like, I use MT4, but like these niggas be OD. Like, when I was on NinjaTrader, it's so simple. Like, it's so much more, like, how can I say this? More like secure. And it's really not like no falsing when it comes to like NinjaTrader and shit. So it'll be easier to tell if a nigga's like that on NinjaTrader than MT4, because. These niggas be doing all types of bullshit, like, but at the end of the day, if they just refuse to show you, like, them live trading, but they're always showing you profits and shit, bro, do not buy that shit, nigga. I'm telling you now, like, do not buy that shit. Also, bro, what you need to be looking for when you're buying these courses or you're trying to invest your own brand or something, bro, you need to see if these niggas are financially free. Like... Like, if I drop the course right now, you better not buy that shit. Why? Because, nigga, I'm not financially free. Why would you want to buy a course from somebody who's teaching you how to invest and how to trade, and they're not even financially free yet? Like, that's not smart, bro. Like, bro, I can't even get himself financially free. Like, how is he going to teach you the ways to get financially free if he's not financially free? You know what I'm saying? And I stand by that. But that don't mean, like... Just because somebody flexing the Lambo and some money and shit, and they just have a computer randomly in the background, that don't mean buy that shit. Because you go on Instagram, you go on a lot of things, like, that's all, you'll see a lot of that. People acting like they're traders, like, renting Airbnbs, renting these foreign whips and shit, and getting niggas to buy that course because they look like they have money. Like, that's not what I'm saying. If they can have a Lambo, all that shit. Fucking 10 monitors on Instagram. You know them Instagram posts and shit. Them niggas be looking at the monitor, have like 10 screens right there. Man, fuck that. If them, if you have not seen this nigga trade live, no trade breakdowns, no nothing, I'm not copping the course. Simple, bro. Like, simple like that, bro. Like, I gotta see, I gotta see you trade live, like, or trade breakdowns really live to me, to be honest, bro. Like, cause them trade breakdowns, there's nothing for me to just come on this bit and just be like, bro, all right, so, uh, I got in on this, on this movement right here, bro. You know what I'm saying? Sniper entry, bro. I got in all the way down here. Like, it's really nothing to do that. But I still like to see things like that so I can see what type of strategy they is, like they have. 
that's the thing too like you're kind of like advanced with the trading you're not a complete beginner it's good to look for like live trade or trading breakdown so you can see how they trade because say like you trade with no indicators like i don't really trade with indicators and shit. i'm not going to want to buy a course from somebody who has like 50 of them hoes you know what i'm saying or somebody who mainly uses the fib and shit. i'm not going to want to buy for a course like i'm gonna want to look for somebody who trades similar to me that's why the trading breakdowns and the live trading is so important you're gonna want to look for proof like that they're actually valid like they're constantly consistently withdrawing on some type of scale you know what i'm saying like this is this thing i'm looking for because like i said i i got scammed one time before this was like when i was a complete beginner like, i got scammed because I seen this one nigga on Instagram. I'm not gonna say his name. Like, I'm not gonna say his name at all, but he scammed my ass for sure. And but I didn't let that shit deteriorate me. Cause it's really niggas, like you can go online, you can go on YouTube. I'm I guarantee you it's really niggas out here who be like, bro, if he has a course, bro, he's a scammer, bro. No matter what, he's a scammer, bro. If he sells a course, bro, he's scamming, bro. You can learn this shit for free online. Like, bro, shut that shit up, bro. Like, let's just keep it on 100, bro. This trading shit is one of the hardest things you'll ever do, bro. Like, why the fuck would you not get no mentorship or get no course in this shit? Like, that's stupid. Like, no, you're not going to be a doctor and be like, bro, I don't, I'm not going to school, bro. I'm not spending all that money, bro. I just learn for free. Like, no, like, the people who learn for free, eventually them niggas buy courses years down the line when they not profitable, bro. And I don't even consider myself 100% profitable, but I know for a fact. I would not be in this position at all. Like, I would not be in this position whatsoever. Like, I was still on fucking baby pips just looking at free shit on YouTube. Because at the end of the day, like, I feel like you should buy a course so you can have, like, a good foundation. So then when you do go on YouTube, you can see what's a scam and what's actually, like, some shit you can add to your strategy and shit like that. Because if you just going off just, you just baby pips and then you just go on youtube and shit bro and then you try to find somebody most likely bro i ain't gonna lie you're gonna get scammed like your first time like buying a course you might get scammed but shit that's just you're gonna have to discharge that bitch to the game bro like what are you in this bit for like you first start a business bro money is going to go down the drain somehow some way bro like that's what niggas need to understand like just because you bought a course and it wasn't like that don't mean like you just stop nigga like bro you can open a fucking restaurant and do things completely wrong and that's some money down the drain. But shit, you still learning the business side. Like, you still got things to learn and shit. Same thing with the trading. Just cause you spent money on the course do not mean like, oh, I'm never buying a course again, bro. All these niggas are scams, bro. Like, the niggas who be like, bro, everybody who sells a course is a scam. So you really telling yourself like, bro, this shit really impossible, bro. Like, nobody else in the world is really doing this at all like everybody who do this shit is fraud on youtube like nobody really doing this shit which is stupid like i don't understand them niggas mindsets but that's them niggas and like lastly bro i'm just gonna i'm just gonna say this bro i'm just gonna keep it so 100 bro if you niggas is still fucking joining iml bro i ain't gonna lie that's out bad on your part no cap and i almost joined iml when i was first starting too like i ain't gonna lie i almost did no cap like they just make that shit sound so good bro and i know niggas who've been in iml for like two years bro and the thing that I, it could be niggas who are really like that in there but i i haven't seen it like all the niggas i see in iml bro them niggas is fucking making like fifty dollars a hundred dollars and then like bro tap in bro tap in bro oh, oh we really making money over here bro tap in bro i'm like bro a fifty dollar trade bro like come on bro flexing demo profits bro you gotta look out for that too bro like if niggas is flexing demo profits I don't, i'm not gonna say no names but i seen niggas on youtube like trading like showing a strategy but using it on demo and niggas be like bro yeah this strategy work bro but um uh, it's on demo bro it's not on live but you could do the same thing on live bro you could just do the same thing on demo on live man shut that shit up bro if it was that easy we all be rich off this shit nigga you know what i'm saying like you gotta watch out for that like i said don't join iml i know it's gonna be niggas in the comments niggas be like bro I, I was never a part of iml i almost joined 
But I know it's gonna be niggas who's gonna be like, bro, you ain't never doing a company, but you sound like, bro. If I see ten niggas walking on the highway and getting ran the fuck over, like it don't take no fucking genius to be like, hey, I ain't gonna lie, I'm not finna walk on the highway and get ran over, my nigga. Like, bro, like I, it could be niggas who get after an IML. Like I, it could be niggas. But your chances of finding niggas who really get after it, like, if your buddy is recruiting your ass, bro, like, let's just keep it 100, bro. Like, big pyramid scheme game. Like, if your buddy who fucking never knew about charts after fucking two weeks ago is recruiting you, like, bro, this opportunity is great, bro. Like, we're going to be making, uh, we can do this on the computer and stuff. Like, bro, like, what are you talking about, bro? You not no traitor, bro. Like, but yeah, just to wrap this bit up too, bro. Like I said, bro, don't don't fall for MT4 profits. It can be demo profits, bro. Try to look for live trades. Like try to look for live trades and trading breakdowns, like on a consistent basis. They gotta be financially free. You know what I'm saying? And just don't join IML, bro. That's all I really gotta say, bro. Like, these are the main things that you should be looking for to not get scammed. Like, don't just buy somebody shit because they flexing money and they got cars and shit like that. If they have not showed you one lick of trading, like, then you know what that means. But that's it for this vid, man. I'm going to keep I'm gonna keep consistently dropping vids and shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's 2022, but I'm trying to go as hard as possible. Like, my page is, like, every day, like, it's somebody commenting on their bed, you know what I'm saying? Like, I really fuck with that. It's, like, that shit really motivating, bro. I'm going to keep going as hard as possible with this shit, man. Like, like I said, I really got to turn up. But that's it for the vid, bro. That's 2022, bro. We're going to keep grinding. We out there, bitch. Let go.